the day, nag-decide ako na mag-record ng video na Taglish. So, hindi ito straight English, magsasalita ako in Tagalog, so that I, it will be more relatable and mas madali siyang intindihin, lalo na dun sa mga hindi pa nakakapag-explore ng Canva. So, ano nga ba yung Canva? Ang Canva ay isang tool online na pwede nyo gamitin para mag-design ng kahit anong nasa isip nyo gawin sa ngayon. So, pwedeng Instagram quotes, pwedeng anything really about Instagram, pwede nyo siyang i-design dito kasi pwede ng Instagram Instagram story, pwede na yung mismong Instagram feed, pwede Facebook cover, pwede Facebook post, pwede actually yung ano, YouTube channel art, pwede din dito, pwede din mga resumes, pwede din mga menus, product labels, ganon. So, lahat ng maisipan mong i-design or i-layout, pwede nang gawin sa Canva ngayon. Very flexible si Canva. And ang maganda kay Canva, pwede siyang gamitin kahit libre. And and pwede mo din naman siyang um, bayaran monthly para magamit mo yung mga premium na benefits kagaya ng mga mag-set up ng brand kit. Magsisimula tayo sa paggawa ng account. So, kung wala pa kayong account sa Canva, ito yung makikita nyo as soon as you open canva.com. So, ito yung tatanungin niya, Canva, um, bago ka ba sa Canva, sign up na, ganyan. So, ano ka ba, teacher or sujante, uh, may startup business ka ba, or blog owner ka ba, or meron ka bang malaking kumpanya, or meron kang... Um, non-profit or charitable institution and stuff like that. So, ang lagi kong pinipili dito aside from small business um, would be personal. So, kung gagamitin mo lang naman siya for your home, family, or friends, then you can choose personal. Personally, I don't think magmamatter naman talaga yung choices dito. I think, ano lang to, siguro profiling lang ni Canva kung sino yung mga gumagamit ng tool nila. Meron akong iba't ibang accounts and napansin ko wala naman talaga siyang pinagkaiba. I can tell you right now, hindi ito isang malaking dahilan para mag-worry ka na, ay, mali yata yung napili ko and stuff like that. So, you can always start with personal kasi doon naman talaga tayo lahat. Magpa-practice tayo para sa sarili natin, di ba? Um, kung may business ka naman na ngayon and um, marunong ka ng mag-design and all and gusto mong designan yung blog mo or yung startup business mo, gusto mong gawan ng logo, gusto mong gawan ng... Um, ano ba, yung mga Facebook cover, ganyan. So, you can choose small business. Kung estudyante ka naman ngayon, nag-aaral and all that, or nagtuturo, and you want to explore Canva, and you want to teach that to your students, of course, you can choose education. Um, now, um, for the benefit, or for this tutorial, I would suggest, let's just use um, personal. So, let's click on personal. Alright, and then, ang lagi kong nire-recommend dito is sign up with email. Bakit? Kasi kapag kahalimbawa na deactivate yung Facebook mo, mawawalan ka na rin ng access sa Canva. I would much rather um, you sign up with the email kasi aside sa ito yung pinakamadaling option and kapag ka nakalimutan mo yung password mo, ito yung pinakamadaling way para makuha mo yung password mo. Kasi mag-forget password ka lang, mag email sila sa'yo and marireset mo na yung password mo. So, I would recommend this one. Ayun. So, gawa tayo ng isa pang account para masundan ninyo kung paano gumawa. Okay? So, sa full name, of course, you can put your name and then email address. And then, confirm email. Retype nyo lang yung email address. Uh, make sure kompleto yung email address, ha? Hindi pwedeng wala yung at something.com. So, dapat meron yan. Um, and then, password. Um, make sure na secure din yung password na pipiliin mo. Huwag yung madaling mag-guess. So, again, you check I'm not a robot. Tapos, minsan lalabas to, captcha. And you just have to, ano, kung ano yung hinihingi niya, you just have to comply. Okay, ayun. So, verified na tayo. Just click on sign up. And then, I'll click save password para hindi na ako mag-input ng password every time. Now, dito naman, let's start creating beautiful designs. Ayan. So, this is a, a more specific compared dun sa pinakita kanina. So, ano tayo dito? Hmm. So, maybe I will choose business owner, manager, or social media manager. Sige, eto. I think this is um, a good choice. 
Alright? And then, dito, pwede ka na mag-add nung mga gusto mong isali sa team mo. Pero, um, isiskip muna natin ito kasi hindi pa ito yung primary consideration natin at this time. Ayun. So, i-verify natin. Ayan. So, ganun lang kadali paano mag-sign up sa Canva. Um, what you need to do is just to input your email address, tapos mag-assign mag ka lang ng password for your account, and then, yun na, makaka-create ka na ng account mo sa Canva. And then, um, I think lahat ng bagong account sa Canva ngayon, diretsyo na siya sa Canva 2.0. So, ito, nakikita yung interface ngayon, Canva 2.0 na ito. If you want to create a new design, you can just click on Create a Design. Tapos, kung ano yung nakikita nyo ngayon, yan yung home. Alright? Tapos, kung gusto nyo mag-create ng team, just click create a team. So, ano nga ba yung nangyayari sa team? So, yung team, um, kumbaga parang ano yan, parang group. So, pwede kayong mag-share ng designs nyo with each other. Pwede nyo i-edit yung um, ginagawa ng isa. So, this is helpful if you are working in a team. Pero kung solo ka lang naman, it's it's fine to not have a team. So, it's not a requirement for you to have a team para mag-create ng projects in Canva. Ayun. So, ano yung brand kit? Yung brand kit, yan yung branding mo. Yung colors mo, yung fonts mo, yung logos mo, and all that stuff. So, if you have um, a free Canva, pwede ka lamang maglagay ng tatlong colors dito sa brand colors. And hindi ka pwedeng mag-upload ng logo, hindi ka pwedeng maglagay ng font combination, yung lagi mong ginagamit, at hindi ka rin pwedeng mag-upload ng fonts. So, makukuha mo lang, or magagamit mo lang tong privilege na to kapag ka may Canva for work ka. Tapos, lahat ng bagong create na Canva account, you have actually the chance na mag, uh, mag-try ng Canva for work for one month. Um, meron akong video, but in English, o kung paano magkaroon ng Canva for Work account. So, ililink ko din siya sa description box below para you can go over the tutorial as well para masundan nyo and matry nyo yung one month na free trial. Okay? And then, um, nakabasa din ako ng announcement pala na anytime soon, magkaka- ilo-launch na yung Canva Design School. So, watch out for that. That's a really nice way to learn Canva. So, kung hindi mo pa kabisado ang Canva or kung nagsisimula ka pa lang, of course, there are so many tutorials available on the internet. So, itong Canva Design School would be a really nice way for all of us to learn something new. And then, folders, kapag ka naka-free Canva ka, may dalawang folder ka. And then, kapag ka naka-Canva for work, naka-unlimited folder ka. Tapos, kung gusto mo makita lahat ng designs mo, punta ka lang dito sa All Your Designs. Hindi pa na, wala tayong makikita dito kasi bago yung account, kaka-create lang. And then, kapag ka may isineer sa'yo, halimbawa may client ka, gusto niyang i-share sa'yo yung ginawa niyang template kasi gusto niyang ipa-edit, pwede kang pumunta dito sa shared with you and dito lalabas yung file na gusto niya, gustong i-share sa'yo. And then, of course, kung may meron kang nilagay sa trash bin na design, dito siya mapupunta sa trash. If you want to upgrade naman, just click on upgrade and ito siya. Um, you will be able to try Canva for Work for 30 days. So, again, if you want to watch yung how to upgrade um, to Canva for Work, I'll link the video sa description box. Alright? So, yun lang. Ganun lang po kadali paano mag-create ng um, Canva account. If you have any questions po, just leave it in the comments box below. Um, if you like this video, if you want me to create more Taglish videos, which I'm really trying hard. <laughs> um, please comment down below as well. Um, and if you are not following the channel yet, please click the subscribe button and click the notification bell also para kapag nag-publish ako ng bagong video, um, manonotify ka sa phone mo or sa email mo mag a yun, na may bago akong video na in-upload. So yon. thank you again for watching and you all have a great day. Bye-bye!